Hi, welcome to Engineering Made Easy Lalit here. Today we will see what happens when we change the scale of a function. So if I denote this uh, Laplace transform of f of t by f bar s then the what would be the Laplace transform of f of a t that is on scaling on changing the scale the Laplace transform of f of a t we will see that it would be 1 by a f bar of s by a we will see it with the proof okay so let's see how to get this by the definition of Laplace transform we know that the Laplace transform of a function f of a t would be integral 0 to infinity e to the power minus st f of a t dt so at the place of f of t we have here f of a t as our function now we will substitute this a t by x okay and uh, we will differentiate it with respect to x or we can also differentiate this with respect to t uh, for the substitution so if i differentiate it with respect to x then i get a dt by dx here t and x are the variable parameters equals to dx differentiation of x with respect to x is 1 so i get a dt equals to dx by a and if i differentiate it i can also differentiate it with respect to t also then uh, it would be a and uh, differentiation of t with respect to t is 1 so a t a t is differentiation with respect to t is a equals to dx by dt so from this also i get dt equals to dx by a now i will see the limits since here it is dt so these limits are from 0 to infinity t equals to 0 to t equals to infinity now i want to change this dt to dx so the limits would be from x equals to something to something the limits would be in terms of x so when t equals to 0 substitute here t equals to 0 i have x equals to 0 and when i have t equals to infinity the upper limit if i put t equals to infinity here then i will get x equals to a into infinity that is infinity so the limits from 0 to infinity t equals to 0 to infinity are not changed in case of dx so limits are from x equals to 0 to x equals to infinity okay so there is no change in the limits now see this this can be written as 0 to infinity e to the power minus e to the power minus s and at the place of t i can write x by a from this okay so it is x by a f of a t this f is f and a t is uh, substituted by x so f of x and dt has been replaced by dx by a so it is dx by a i have this expression now you can see that uh, it uh, now take this uh, a out so it is 1 by a 0 to infinity e to the power minus and just uh, rearrange this this s take this s inside and x out so it becomes minus of uh, s by a into x f of x dx this a has been taken out now it's time to compare this uh, you can uh, compare this with this equation this is the equation of the definition of Laplace transform of a function f of t and here it is written that uh, the Laplace transform of f of t which is denoted by f bar of s is equals to integral 0 to infinity e to the power minus st f of t dt uh, now at, at the place of uh, f of t dt i have there f of x uh, dx then when it is e to the power minus st f of t dt then it was f bar of s but now at the place of s i have here s by a okay here i have s by a so this would be replaced this s would be replaced by s by a just uh, compare these two okay so it is nothing but 1 by a and this this form is can be written as f bar of s by a from by comparing with this okay so hence it is proved so you can uh, also subscribe my channel for getting more such videos in future when I upload it. And um, you can also visit my blog www.engineeringmadeeasypro.com. Okay. So thanks for watching. Bye-bye.